Hello everybody, welcome back to Gadgets Portal. So Filmora 13 has just been launched and today in this video I will talk about the best feature on this software but before that here is a quick tip for you guys which is also something new on Filmora. When you have a big project with multiple long videos, if you are looking for any specific clip or it becomes quite tiresome because uh, you need to be scrolling like this holding the playhead it takes time patience and energy three new playback speed shortcut keys has been added to filmora 13 jk and l keys with this hot keys you can navigate through the video clips more efficiently by clicking the l key you can speed up the playback to 2x and with the k key you can pause it with the j key you can rewind the video so this is how you can navigate through the clips with the L key again you can normalize the playback and another click will 2x the speed again you can make it 4x 6x 8x 16x even up to 32x another click will again play the video at normal speed let's rewind at 1x 2x 4x 6x 8x and 16x 32x stop scrolling anytime with the k key to play the video you can use the space bar of course so this is how with these three hotkeys you can find specific moments or skim through any project quickly this will improve the editing workflow by saving time when searching for and selecting clips Next, let's talk about text-based editing in Filmora 13. With the help of AI, you can convert the audio in your video into text which allows you to edit your videos just like the way you do on your Word files. It sounds crazy and it makes working with Filmora 13 so much easy and fun. So it's ready and as you can see guys, some text files have been added which are basically like transcription of the audio in the video. You can keep them as subtitles. Adding subtitles has never been so easier. Now the fun part is if you select any text, the corresponding video with the audio will be selected automatically. So with text-based editing, you can find specific dialogues, specific scenes. If there is no voice or dialogue that is also specified here, you can move the playhead around the clips and the cursor on the text also moves. So instead of listening to what the voice is saying, you can read. And the fun part is if you delete any text, the corresponding video with the dialogue will be deleted as well just like you do on word files not only that if you cut and paste the text anywhere on the transcription the corresponding video will also be cut and paste to that location you can also obviously duplicate clips by copying the text and pasting it anywhere else on the timeline so that's how you can do text based editing in the new filmora 13 before you export, you can also go to the subtitles editor. So let's go to the subtitles editor and here you can make any corrections as needed. You can also change the subtitle fonts with presets, customize them and also add animations. This is the output here and with text based editing, you are not only using text to edit videos, you are using speech to text technology using the power of artificial intelligence and creating subtitles for your videos. And I think this is one of the best new addition to the Filmora 13 video editor. For more Filmora 13 videos, check the description of this video. I hope that this video was interesting and enjoyable. Thank you so much for watching guys.